What's up, YouTube? Dan to be an H guy. I just got back from the Goodwill Hudson, New Hampshire. I spent forty nine dollars forty cents. That was after twenty five, uh, the twenty percent discount and a five dollar off uh, coupon from the receipt, guys. So uh, nothing too crazy today, but I found a few good things. Uh, first up is a uh, Nike Dry Fit, Dry Fit, uh, the Nike T Men's T-shirt, extra large. Offense, defense. So uh, yeah, Nike Dry Fit. It's got a graphic, uh, graphic print on the front, guys. Double swoosh. Hopefully, get about 21, 22 bucks of this. Next on deck, I gotta look this up. The Nike T Dry Fit, and it says Nike uh, says Elite, I believe, on the front. So it's the Elite series. Um, I'm not sure what this goes for, guys. It's only a size medium, but um, I'm gonna look this up. Hopefully, about 22 bucks when it's all said and done. Next up, guys, is a vintage um, single stitch T-shirt by American Apparel. It says Pavement Coffee House X Boston, Massachusetts, um, on the front, guys. So. Vintage single stitch. It's got a cool graphic on it. And I think somebody's going to pick this up, guys. And uh, here's an American Apparel tag. So I'm going to probably get to try to get at least 25 bucks for this. Next here is a, another Nike Dry Fit, the Nike T. And this has got a big swoosh on the front, guys. And uh, nothing special here, but um, hoping to get at least 20 bucks for this. And that is a size size medium, not the best size. I found this uh, North Face long sleeve quarter zip men's jacket, size large. And I got it for a good price. I got it for $4.80, so I had to pick it up. I'm going to try to get at least 30, 35 bucks of this. It's a pretty decent shape. The North Face. So, I pulled the trigger on this. Um, size large. This here is a uh, Nui Tags Primal um, Men's cycling jersey and this is for lily diabetes new attacks um gonna try to get between 25 and 30 bucks for this guys size large men's this right here i'm gonna look up i haven't looked up yet but i thought it was pretty cool this is by giddy up this is shipyard Old Port Half Marathon. It's got a cool map on it, guys. Um, this is, I think this is, uh, I think it might be, this might be Maine. Yeah, this is up in Maine, guys. And, um, yeah, hopefully uh, I'll get a pretty good price for this, between 25 and 35 bucks. Hopefully it's something, uh, something kind of rare. So. Yeah, I picked that up, guys. That was pretty cool. This right here was a nice little find, guys. This is a 511 Tactical Series San, Anto San Antonio, Texas Fire Department Men's Polo Shirt, new with tags. So, this is four dollars eighty cents, and uh, I should get at least thirty five for this. I'm assuming. Let's get the graphic logo on it, guys. And um, yeah, nice find right here, guys. Size large. So, 5.11 Tactical. Next up is a men's golf polo shirt by Footjoy. And this is the Hilton Head National. I'll have to look that up to see where, it's, where it is. But uh, yeah, nothing too special here, guys. I'm going to try to get at least 20 bucks for this. 
maybe $22, um, size extra large. It's got the embroidered logo on the front, Foot Joy on the back. Foot Joy has definitely come down in price, unless you can find the uh, FJ on the collar. If you find it up on the collar, definitely pick it up, guys. Um, it's a nice little shirt right here. I think this is vintage. Um, this is Chaps by Ralph Lauren. This is a men's Hawaiian um, floral camp shirt, guys. And this is a size medium. Um, I looked these up. They're going for pretty good prices. I'm probably going to start this at 35 bucks, guys. And I'm pretty sure it's vintage. Pretty sweet. Last shirt I have is this uh, Tommy Bahama men's t-shirt. It's got the big graphic on the back. And uh, fish you wear here, Tommy Bahama. It's in really good shape, size extra large. I'm going to look this up. Probably, uh, I'm going to try to get at least 25 bucks for it, guys. And uh, last stuff I found this puzzle. 750 uh, piece uh, balloon puzzle guys this was only a buck and I looked this up and uh, one sold recently for about $30 so I think there's another one online for about 30 35 bucks so yeah this box is definitely banged up but it's still new with the seal the back the uh, factory seal guys so I'm gonna try to get at least 28 to 32 dollars for this and uh, that's all I got for today, guys. So I'm going to get to work uh, listing stuff on eBay. And uh, that's about it. So we'll talk soon, guys. Thanks for watching. Peace.